Flat earthers use the word perspective. They say, the reason that things disappear from your view is because they move too far away from you for your visual acuity to be able to make them out. They would use shots like these, either staring down a hallway or some long corridor, or in this case, beneath the lane of the Atchafalaya Basin Bridge. Their arguments go like this. When we use our senses and look at the world, we can see that the water is flat and that scenes like these show that lines stay straight and do not curve. Therefore, the earth is flat. But these arguments fail to consider the scale of the earth. Just as you need a microscope to see small things, you can use a telephoto lens to see large things that are far away. For example, New Orleans can be seen from Mandeville as it's obstructed by the horizon. With curvature like this clearly visible, flat earth gurus had to scramble with ad hoc explanations. Flat Earth Guru's out was the claim that there was no curvature and that the obstruction was caused by some magical phenomenon called convergence. This is now known as Fleurspective. The Fleurspective argument can be defeated by finding structures that demonstrate the curvature of the Earth as it moves away from the observer. The causeway, for example, clearly demonstrates such curvature. Also, from the south shore, both the curvature of the causeway and the obstruction of the Marriott by the horizon can be seen in the same frame. But what about those long hallways? Well, with a telephoto lens, even the long hallways are shown to curve. So the next time your favorite flat earth minion uses the word perspective, just know he really means flirspective.